Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. In today's video, we are going to be using bananas. I like to eat these, I like them for my smoothies, but best of all, I like to use them topically on the skin. Banana is rich in potassium, helps a lot moisture in the skin. It also contains a vitamin C, and the peel of the banana is great for reducing hyperpigmentation on the skin, blackheads, whiteheads, you name it. So what I'm going to do, I am going to show you how I make a three different facial masks using the banana. So if you're interested, if you're looking for a way to use up your leftover bananas, this recipe is for you. So continue watching. So here we have a large ripe banana and banana is rich in potassium. It is also rich in sodium. It contains electrolytes, which help to lock moisture in the skin. It also contains skin brightening properties in the form of a vitamin C. What I'm doing with the banana, I'm peeling and chopping. And next I'm going to be blending to a puree. Now, if you do not have a blender for this, go ahead and use a fork or a whisk and just mash the banana. Bananas tend to get dark when exposed to here, so it's going to get a little dark. Not to worry, it is still very much good to use. You can also choose to add a dash of lemon or lime juice to this, just a dash to keep the color if you are, you know, so into the color. Now let's move on to the first facial mask. It's going to be banana turmeric face mask. This is the mask that's going to help to lighten and brighten the skin. I'm using one tablespoon of the banana puree. Go ahead and double up if you need to make more. Next, I'm reaching for some milk and I'm using one teaspoon of milk, which is rich in lactic acid. I'm also going to be using some turmeric powder and I'm using about a dash of turmeric powder and I'm going to mix the three ingredients together, mixing banana, turmeric and milk. And once this is totally blended together, the mask is now ready to use on the face. This I like to also use as a facial wash. So you can actually apply it on the skin, rub it on in circular motion, and then you can rinse it off. It's going to have to lighten, brighten, or you can apply it on the skin, leave it on the skin for 30 minutes, and then you rinse off. Choose to use it as a wash or choose to use it as a facial mask. A really good mask, especially for rough, dull skin. Now let's move on to my second mask. This is going to be banana honey facial mask. So here I have the banana puree and I'm going to use one tablespoon of the banana puree. Remember, if you want to make more of this, double up on the ingredient. My next ingredient is going to be some milk. And I'm using about a teaspoon of milk in this. Let's pour this in. One teaspoon of milk. If you are vegan, go ahead and use some soy milk. And now let's reach for the honey. And I'm using about a half a teaspoon of the honey. So pour this in. So here we have banana, milk, and honey. And we are going to blend the three ingredients together. Mix well. This one also, you can use it as a facial wash to wash your face or you can use it as a facial mask apply it on the skin in circular motion and apply it for about three minutes and then you rinse off if you're using as a mask leave it on for at least 15 to 30 minutes and then you rinse off all these are great to use every day on the skin since they are all natural and you can use them on the face the neck and decollete so there you have it uh, three ways to use banana on the skin store the leftovers in the refrigerator and use it up within seven days now my third mask is going to be a uh, banana yogurt mask so i'm going to be using one tablespoon of the banana puree and next i'm going to reach for some yogurt and i'm going to use about a tablespoon of yogurt make sure you're using unsweetened plain yogurt 
adding this to the bowl and now we are gonna mix and we are gonna mix well mixing the two ingredients together just banana and yogurt now if you want to kick this up a notch if you want to make it into even a more skin tightening mixture you can go ahead if you have fuller's earth go ahead and add a dash of fuller's earth to this recipe next i'm reaching for my final ingredient and this is going to be some coconut oil help to hydrate up to nourish and help to lock moisture in the skin and i'm gonna mix this in and mix well so for this recipe we use one tablespoon of banana puree one tablespoon of yogurt and about a teaspoon of coconut oil and now let's pour this in our storage jar and take a look at this this is just amazing so pour in and you're gonna use this on your skin just like the others you can use it as a facial mask and you can use it as a facial wash go ahead and apply it on the face the neck and decollete in circular motion and then rinse off if you're using it as a facial mask apply it on the skin leave it on for 20 to 30 minutes and then rinse off safe to use every day and store the leftovers in your refrigerator and there you have it, uh, three ways to use banana on the skin. The first mask was our turmeric mask for lightening and brightening the skin. Fade dark spot, leave with a glowing skin. Also good for anti-aging purposes. The second mask is a banana yogurt mask. And this mask is good for clearing dark spots, shrinking large pores, hydrating and decreasing wrinkles and fine lines on the skin. And our third mask is our banana honey mask. A mask that is good for replenishing moisture to the skin is a great anti-aging mask. It also contains vitamin C and it also contains vitamin E. Three masks using banana on the skin. Try one or try all. Come back and leave it.